Hello, ladies, gents, and cock-hungry ghosts. We return to the mountains of madness, where terrible evil specters are possibly haunting us this very moment. They're invisible, indetectable, impossible to know where they're at. Oh, yeah, eat the colonists. Finally got rid of that terrible debuff of having the dumbass be... Uh, you know, being a, a a problem. Seems like now, the other one went away though. <laughs> they not they not seem to approve of what I just did. Which was butchering the person that was giving me a diva because he was not buried. Well, he is no longer present in one piece. It is now just meat that we can eat. Don't know what happened to the lady though. Uh, I guess she did not enjoy the fact that her friend was made into meat. Where even was she? I'm talking about there was two idiots. It was like Kanto and Kanta or something like that. But now she's just she's just gone. I don't know whatever happened. And I don't even know if she was still around. It is just weird that quest. Wasn't failed or nothing. I don't understand. I don't understand what just happened. I think it may have even been bugged for because we fulfilled the quest that they were related to, and they just stuck around. Maybe it had to do with that quote-unquote colonist being unburied, and it kind of got stuck, and that's why now uh, it is gone from the list. That was kind of bizarre, but I am glad I got resolved. Did the debuff go away? Yes, indeed. The, there is no longer that silly, silly debuff. I was doing a little bit of tidying up in between episodes, putting a whole bunch of... Oh, yeah, yeah, I butchered the weird thing. What does it yield? That uh, weird specter. Twisted meat. Pieces of twisted muscle and gristle. Bloated with tumorous growths. These bizarre shreds of flesh must have come from a horrific creature. Do you... Can you make them into meals? Are they an ingredient? It is on the list. Probably don't want to put it in your tray of steak and eggs, right? You don't want to have mystery ball uh, meatballs. Probably that is a step too far, even for us cannibals. Don't want to just leave it for uh, major stupid to eat. Maybe she'll enjoy it. I guess for now, we'll just keep it here. But maybe we'll even move it to the waste freezer that we're building over here. All right. Hopefully, we can build and do all this tidying up that I want to get done before uh, there's any more events. Like, I, I just want a little bit of peace. I know that all sorts of madness is happening in the outside world. But for now, we'd like to have a little bit of time to, you know, tidy up everything, make our, ourselves our uh, uh, pen for the animals, deconstruct all that stuff, like clean up all this outside. It's, it's a complete freaking disaster. Why is there a healing enhancer just thrown along with all the chunks? And Masterwork was created. Well done. Well done, Hike. Masterwork beds are, like, excellent. It is super good, duper good. Give you, what is it? Rest of the thing, 125%. That is... A fat increase. That is not a trivial improvement. It is excellent to get Master Wars. That's why I was so pissed when T Rose was T Rose was building beds. Total waste. Anyway, we got another another bed. Let's give it to Megan. There uh, you go. Um, decided to give Filthy Heathen this bed because she needs a little bit of comfort. She's been going through a rough patch. Poor freaking filthy heathen has had a, a bad time of it. How far along is she in conversion, though? Please tell me that she's close. 48% still. Man, it takes forever. Trying to get all the hauling done, all that stuff over there. Finally starting construction of our production area. At last, get a proper colony going here. Haul this garbage out of my face. I even allowed the elephants 
to go into the storage. We're going to have to deal with a little bit of filth. It's no big deal. We're going to just let them. Uh, because the elephants are, are one of our main sources of being able to haul things around. Then not being allowed into the storage area is really slowing down the process of, you know, moving things around. We're going to put the power cells right here. We're going to install one there and one there. And then we're going to close it off with some strong walls. Maybe even plasteel or something. What is my plasteel number right now? I did use a few. Ah, still 827. That is plenty. So... I would like to get another mech going as well, which means I need uh, a brain builder, right? Uh, that will be in biotech, not gene instructor, not the subcore scanner. You need the, the, yeah, the scanner, the scanner. That's the one you want. Um, I will just put it in, in this room. Is there a reason to have it elsewhere? I don't think so. I mean, this is like the mech-related area, right? So this column is like in the worst place. <laughs> the worst place possible. Let's just put it alongside. I just don't like putting it alongside the walls because you can put so many other things alongside the walls. Let's just put it like that, I suppose. There's no good configuration. Just plunk it down in the middle of the damn room and uh, we'll throw a bunch of prisoners in there. Break soul. We may scan your brain before you're out of the prison. Grief or impressive bedroom, huh? I didn't realize that you were. No wonder that you got pissed about your situation. You are freaking greedy. Let's create you a nice, impressive bathroom. Bedroom. Probably it's going to be one of these. Is uh, let's get some floors going, some sandstone. Hmm. Brick Soul can live right back here. And what we're going to do is we're going to mine these out. Mine all these out. And we're actually going to build some real walls with masonry. I think I just heard I heard a, a phone message. I need to go check it. It could be my wife in, in dire danger. Indeed. She was having a terrible emergency of being melting because she dressed too warm. And I... I'm glad that she notified me about this. It's very important for me to know this, even though I can do nothing about it. I told her in the morning, I was like, this is going to be warm today. You're going to be too warm. Like, no, no, I don't want to wanna move to... Anyway, let's give Crack Like Back the priority on dark studies. Actually, let's put him on two. He can do the arts, and then when he's done with the arts... He's going to do some dark studies. He's going to just look real close at this monolith. By the way, it looks dirty and gross. I suppose it's rust or maybe it's just feces coming out from the feces dimension. Truly disgusting. Let's get some time going forward. There's a, a lot of stuff going on. Thankfully, it seems like the Paul, the pale Paul, there is still volcanic winter. So it's darker than it should be. See, the growth rate is 72% instead of 100. That's okay, though. That's okay. Mm. The darkness, though, it seems to not be as awful. It was just nighttime. Very upsetting. That's a lot of rocks. So, holy crap. Sight still <laughs> revealed. A twisted creature has come out of thin air. Absolute idiot buffoon. Next to Banana. Next to literally our best fighter. <laughs> you're good. Oh, you're good. Come. Actually, there's two of them, so we got to respect that. Let's uh, get... Actually, Banana, doesn't he even own some elephants? Yeah, like, Banana is going to absolutely destroy you. <laughs> like, idiot. Crack like Vagbe. Assist. Jesse Fassman. Also assist. You can come over here, I suppose. And that should be plenty. These things don't seem to be all that powerful. They, they're they just ambushers. You know, they're they are other stalking prey. But they're just not intimidating. Pow, pow, pow. Idiot. Oh, there's more than one. Wow, they just go down like complete bitches. There's a lot. Okay, there's more than I anticipated. <laughs> all right, well, I'm not, I'm not worried because they go down so fast. 
Oh man, they okay. Well, maybe I should be worried. <laughs> there is, there is way more than anticipated. Evan Damas, come over here. Uh, you have no weapon, filthy heathen. How about you just keep doing what you're doing? You're doing great. Uh, anybody else that is close by? Not really, but Eric, Erica Dawson should be able to make it. And Meg as well. She can club some heads, and Hike loves to involve herself in such things. Everybody should get involved in this because I have not, like, this may be half of them. It may be one tenth of them. So let's take it really seriously. A crack like Vagus is going to bring them down. But they maybe also do quite a lot of damage. Some scratches going on on Crack like Vagby. Oh, jeez. Oh, they're coming for Jesse. If in Demos, release the animals. Release the animals. Move, Jesse. Oh, wow. They, they, they are trying to surround me and stuff. Going after Banana. Well done, well done. Yeah, 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 they keep coming. I'm, I'm glad that I enlisted everybody else. Because this can be a problem. Jasmine got bitten, but not too bad. If in damage, how about you let the elephants do the talking over here? Uh, get yourself a, a little bit of distance. Oh, looks like we are actually stunning a couple of them. Banana, it would be awesome if you maybe did not get involved in physical altercations. I think this may be the last of it. Are we done? No, oh, she's shooting. Oh yeah, there's plenty more coming. All right, <laughs> this is uh, a never-ending pile of monsters. These seems to be all, seem to be all dead though. Okay, crack like Vagve. Actually, you're not doing great. How about you retire? Before you go down, let me just send you down to the hospital. Lego, my Mega is going to take over the defense. Ooh, a dark shard. No, a shard of dark ar arco technology. Collect and make use of it. Show me. A scavenged fragment of dark arco technology. Originally created by a hyper intelligent architect mind, the shard is packed. With the technology beyond human from <laughs> comprehension. It is capable of manipulating psychic flows, inducing Arcotech influences, and giving you an AI girlfriend. While it is useless by itself, it can be built into devices that harness its power to produce exotic effects. It's basically Eldritch Component, I will, will be my interpretation of shards. We'll see what we can create with that. But uh, it's not over. It's not over, everybody. This thing is crawling, it looks like. <laughs> T-Rows, get yourself over there. Do I even want to capture these things? Hike. Teach them how it's done. Actually, form a line with Meg. Wah! Kapush! <laughs> the way that she always just jumps into the fray always uh, gives me joy. Get closer, banana. I don't want you to be. Uh... Ooh! How many are we dealing with here? And why is Stump Master not attacking? I really don't want Derricka Dawson to get wrecked here. Let's make sure that Hike takes the brunt of this damage. The jump pack is so good. I absolutely love it. It's one of the best things you can. You can nice, nice shot there, Blargo. Excellent, excellent job, <laughs> you idiot. Please, are we done? Okay, okay, banana, you're a little too excited here. It's the problem with the melee attackers is uh, a lot of friendly fire. Most of these wounds are from friendly fire, and so we're pretty good. Let me get some furniture, uh, some sleeping spots for our roaming animals. I put some here for the boomalopes. These should not be medical, really. There you go. This should be for the roaming, roaming animals. That is a lot. We're going to be butchering all this nonsense. And then there's a whole bunch of them that are capturable. I don't have holding pens at the moment. 
I wanted to make this whole area into our holding pens. This is a decent spot, though. Fat haired nerd can just have no home whatsoever. And we'll just have to deconstruct it. And, um, I am investigating it. Oh, it will be an anomaly, huh? But you can have a holding spot. Spot for holding dangerous entities. Not as good as a steel holding platform, but a lot better than nothing. Down entities can be secured as a holding spot where they can be studied. Increase containment strength by building strong walls and doors and other special containment devices. Oh, wow, that's big. That's what she said. We put that there. Uh, I guess we'll capture one. Wonder if it's important to capture a whole bunch or just one is fine or what. Let's see. Take stock of our wounds. Oof. I got shot by a stray bullet. Don't know how that happened. Go over there. Crackack back is the one that got hit pretty hard. Meg just went in there, clubbed some head, completely unscathed. Plot armor activated. Must be season eight of Game of Thrones going on with her. Jesse Fastman, you also need to rest into the yield. And poor filthy heathen. That's it. That's it. Pretty rough. It's okay. We're heading towards that a moment. Where's no going to come? You're going to see a huge number of distant psych stealers screaming in their twisted rage. They are coming. A huge number, huh? <laughs> Holy crap! Uh, this tells me I need I need some walls. It's like I cannot. Like, was this a huge number? Let me check the message history. Sight stealers shrieking in the distance. This one says a huge number. It is time to get ourselves some colony walls. This is not something that I want to repeat. That was a, a pretty rough assault. I mean, we didn't get that damaged. But if another troop comes and it's way more than that, I want to have to deal with that. So let's put this wall right there. I was going to have an extremely strong plasteel door like so. But you know how it goes. You actually want to do something like, um, you know, a bit of a choke point. Um, maybe even a fallback option like that. Let me put that a little bit further. Like that and what you do you put fences so they can't use that as cover that should be pretty good probably also want to do something like this that fits a lot of people in there okay that should be pretty okay and I'm actually going to prioritize... Ah, Blargo is the doctor. How about Ragman? Ragman is doing okay. He's just meditating his life away. Just completely oblivious to the crisis going on up there. Get me some walls, Ragman. What are you guys doing? Oh, they're going to... because They still have queued... Uh, sleeping over here. Let me just eliminate these. There. Yeah, there you go. They're going back to over there and now i can uh, put them back on for the boomalopes i mean it's not like it matters right now but eventually it will um okay good fast man get it done who else can build these walls hike is also a very good builder but you know we need to treat these wounds why are you treating Diver with freaking medicine? Oh, no, I think even Diver is tending to himself. Um, let me go to the health tab. Make sure everybody... Thank you again. Thank you, thank you for that tip. I did not know you could do that. That is very, very useful. Holy crap, is that useful. Even Diver just... just Tend to hike. As you 
shit on her. <laughs> and that was spoke negatively of Crackle Back with his eloquence. I have no idea how to speak. Do not even look at me sideways. Why are you putting that there? The healing enhancer. Why why is this not medication only? Clear what the Why are these shelves for anything other than medicine? Ridiculous. There. Their soul is howling outside. I am very traumatized. Do we have any other builder? Tiro's dabbles, and she is trying to construct a thing. How about you go out there and do some some wall building? Um, Blargo, what are you doing? You're building a sandstone wall. How about you build back some freaking tissues? Because Cracklock Vagve is falling apart. Come over here. I mean, Jesse Fassman is here. She can self-tend. So weird how sometimes it just doesn't give you the option. What are you doing? Tending through clack clack back? Sure, you, you do and go and do that. Okay, bl fine. Blargo will build these walls. Like it, tell, it didn't tell me anything on whether they're coming right now or in a little while. Meditating. Meditating. Are you for serious? Get to building. And I would like also. Fat her nerd, how about you go and capture sight stealer? Give me the one that is the least dead. <laughs> That'll be great. 14 hours, that's pretty good. Capture sight stealer. There you are. Wonder if they heal by themselves. Do you need to do you need to do anything to them or what? Holding spot, there you are. Entity. Study, maintain, release, and execute, huh? Certainly study. Can you do any medical at all? You have zero. But, I mean, it's just a freaking disgusting spawn of chaos. So let me just give you the ability to Take duct tape and stick it on top of its wounds. And that's the, the guy that's on char in charge. Uh, I am quite concerned about this giant pile of sight stealers waiting somewhere in the horizon. Tainan is ready to obliterate my freaking colony with his uh, enormous group of monsters. Stop. I know that I've told you to... I've told you to... Actually, how about you build the door? I've told you to meditate. Right now, there's far more pressing concerns. Uh, by the way, also, we need to heal these poor elephants, brother. At least none of them are in danger of dying, but Blargo really should have doctor over construction. I don't know why, when that was changed, but certainly... He needs to patch up those poor elephants. Where are you going? Bruh. <laughs> go to the animals. Uh, over here. There you go. Silly, silly Blargo. Okay, he's going off to tend to them. What are you doing, t -Rose? You don't need to, like, do you really need meals? Not really. We have plenty of meals. I really want these walls built. We're going to micromanage the crap out of it. Fathead nerd, doing a good job. <laughs> select the entity. Select holding spot. No, select the entity. Health. There you go. Well done, fathead nerd. Great job putting that duct tape on those wounds. I'm hearing the most hideous noises. I don't like it. Uh, I would like to butcher these. I think it, getting that twisted meat. I put it on, do, just do it once and see what happens. You just get a bunch of twisted meat, do it forever. I um, isolated the sight stealers on that dialogue right there. Oh, okay, it's just a, it's just a masterwork. <laughs> Hike is building masterworks. Hike. Hike. You should be working. For sure. 
Her crack like vibe is still bleeding all over the place, huh? How about you clean this hospital? I have completely neglected crack like vibe. Is Banana doing okay? Is everybody else properly healed? Yeah, it's all good. Uh, I'm good. Crack like vibe 100% is going to get a freaking infection. There's a 0% chance of that being avoided. Come on, come on. This, these wallets are almost there. Come on, Ragman. Are you doing okay? You do need a little bit of sleep, but you can work through the night. Don't be a pussy. In fact, we're going to send T Rose to get some more construction done. Neglect. Neglect that thing. Meg, did, did I give you that bed? Didn't I give that to Nostra F in Damas? I don't remember, but. It should be okay. We still have to repair that mechanoid. Poor Jesse Fassman. Is, no wonder he's taking forever to heal him. Uh, Evan Damas. Instead of tending to mother-in-law, how are you coming here? As soon as that bar is over. There you go. Come in here and heal him. Jesse Fassman. You're still bleeding. You absolute buffoon. Just lay down. <laughs> it's upsetting. So freaking upsetting. Okay, hopefully Hike can finish these walls. Obviously, we want to prioritize the walls that uh, bar axis. Okay, Effing Damas is doing that. Are you done bleeding? You are done bleeding. Now tend to Jesse Fastman. Please! Not the greatest <laughs> quality of tending. I didn't expect to be having to micromanage so much in my RimWorld career. So advanced in it. That's good, that's good. Get that one done. We don't care about the outside just yet. Oh. Bruh. <laughs> Filthy heathen. All day, every day. Is something. Okay, punch down as usual. <laughs> Spends more time just taking dirt naps than doing anything else okay blargo did go to sleep do you really need to sleep blargo i really don't think so i believe that you need okay at least she deliver all that oh we ha also have another conversion ready to go come on just build the last one build the last one i can stop micromanaging all right this is great this is great now uh when the sight stealers come, or whatever they are, they're actually called. Break Soul is back! Excellent. Convert Filthy Heathen. Oh, Break Soul. You absolute buffoon. You total moron. Don't know when this happened. That you lost your way. Let me get you out of hauling. You are our resident artist, actually. Smith and Taylor, excellent uh, crafter. And also, of course, the researcher. Give him a two over there. Okay. Mm so he'll craft, and if there's nothing to craft, he'll research. Uh, right now, there's just nothing really going on in either of those realms. Uh, I completely forgot that I eroded this entire wall. Let me just put that wall back up. Uh, yeah, and I wanted a vent because I, I realized the temperature in this generator room was 71 degrees Celsius, which is close. It's not quite, but it is close to boiling water. So, you know, maybe vent it out a little bit. That'll help out quite a bit. There you go. Put that there. Uh, hopefully these travelers get ambushed by sight, see uh, sight stealers and I don't have to deal Oh man, there's some medicine out there. I don't have to deal with... Oh man, oh, why has this not been hauled? I'm like, do I dare? Do I dare to send out? You know something I should do? Have a storage area a low priority storage area for the elephants to go and fetch things. Starvation, huh? And um, 
and they put it in the low priority storage area and then have my colonies and my robots transport it to the places where they belong. Their final resting place. I feel like that is a decent idea. Let me just put a zone and it's just stockpile. And it can be in the middle of everything, like right here. And it's simply a stop like of everything, but with the lowest priority. And that should allow the elephants, <clears throat> which have no access to like the hospital and stuff like that, they can go out and uh, grab the stuff that is way out in the map, you know. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? I believe you do know what I am saying. All right. Finally, it seems like we have a little bit of uh, defense going on. Something that I have completely neglected is having traps of any kind. I mean, it hasn't been that long that we've been here, you know, so it's not like I've been neglectful in the sense that, oh, I'm just twiddling my thumbs and stretching my balls. It's just there's only so many things I can do. Crack like that, but you never finish your beautiful sculpture. Because we ran out of health for you. Let me expand that home area. There you are. I figured, eh, stop being trying to be cute and qu quirky. Just make a giant hospital. Make it as good as you can find it. As you can make it. Very, very nice. Spacious. And also, in a hospital, you can kind of cheat the engine. Having a, a giant empty space and it's very clean and nobody access it. And it kind of brings up the cleanliness of your room. Anyway, this is getting a little out of control. Filthy heathen, are you really just unable to walk? Yes, you are unable to walk. You got punched real good. Magnorish, mind shattering pain. <laughs> Have better days. Have better days. I would love for the diseases to go away, the muscle parasites and all that stuff. The gut worms. Ragman has had such a horrible time with these diseases. The gut worms. It's just awful. Muscle parasites and Jesse Fassman. It's just so obnoxious. All right. That's good. That's good. Good stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Slowly emptying this horrible place. Slowly getting the animals to haul everything that I want them to haul. It just takes a while, but we're making it happen. Fully healed. Excellent. Healing Enhancer. It would be nice to install it on one of these idiots. But uh, not until we have a something a little bit cleaner. How are you doing, prisoner? 7.6. Still a little while. It'll eventually happen, though. Ah, this has been dug out. Let me create some sandstone walls. Like so. This is supposed to be Break Souls room. Eventually... Let's create some furniture. Do I even have enough wood? Oh, there is already one in there. Let me give him a nice sandstone dresser. Or maybe even make it out of something expensive like plasteel. How much is 50? Golden. 500 gold. <laughs> oh, it's stupid. Just give him a freaking sandstone. Do I have granite? Do I, I don't have marble. Uh, put it right here at the foot of the bed. Very nice. This filth should be studied at some point by Crack Like Vagway. Slowly. Oh, yeah, I should be configuring this. Put some sight stealer corpses there so they don't rot. And really, I should have. Uh, I really should have an electric stove by now. We have plenty of electricity. How are we doing with the grid? 4,000 grid excess. Tons and tons and tons of of spare electricity. Okay, that's nice. Oh, we are all dug out with the walls. Let me, let me think of what else I need to dig out. That's the thing with having a digging specialist. You run out of things for them to do, and then they're just twiddling their thumbs. All right, gave them a little bit more of work. Something I wanted to do. I just now saw it. Diver wants to go home. I don't think so, Diver. I thought that you would join on good terms. 
you're going to get put in a cell and we're going to convince you very gently that you actually need to stay and work. So off you go. This Erica Dawson creating all kinds of disgusting twisted meat. Never going to make meals out of that. Maybe I'll make one meal. Have somebody eat it. See what happens. It should be hilarious. We'll feed it to fat her nerd. See what happens. In fact, I'm now instantly curious. Let me create uh, one simple meal. And it's going to be out of twisted meat. Okay. Tiros, I would like you to cook this meal. Yeah, there, off she goes. Ah, yes, delicious. You now have a simple meal with twisted meat. Let's hope all that happens is they get food poisoning. It'll be hilarious, though, if they grow tentacles. <laughs> so let me see what happens. For science! We're just uh, studying the dark arts. Don't judge me. Greatness requires sacrifice. It's all that matters. Advance our, uh, our understanding of what's going on in the Mountains of Madness. Here we came to have some kind of... Uh, kind of like a retirement kind of place where we could peacefully build a ship. I'm being assaulted by horrible monstrosities. Let's eat their flesh and see what happens. Absolutely nothing. I mean, he, he didn't like that. He ate a twisted meal. <laughs> Not like eating cancer. I want to throw up. <laughs> I am glad I did it, though. <coughs> that is what you have slaves for. Uh, that reminds me, too. Do we still have... It's so worthless. The Psychic Sooth Pulsar. It's so worthless. It's like, gives you a... A mood boost for like a day. So like just sell it. Sell it, sell it immediately. The moment you get it. Alright, but I'm glad that all of this thing is, is happening pretty nicely. Let me install this wall light. How dare I not put them where it's symmetrical. If you, you may or may not notice that it is queued up. Have them equally spaced. Because it was driving me crazy that they were all willy-nilly all over the damn place man the the stone cutters just cannot keep up with the amount of stones all over the place it's out of control we'll eventually have all these walls built all right this is very nice i'm very happy that we got some walls going on will not be caught off guard i mean we will sort of be caught off guard because they are freaking invisible but we shouldn't have to deal with a giant run amok group like that. We'll be able to use that choke point, hopefully. Mm. I had something else in mind, and then I completely forgot it again. Oh, what's this? Dread leather. Thick, tough leather taken from some monstrous creature. The surface is covered in ugly scars and whorls and smells faintly of rotten meat. Most people would be unhappy if made to wear apparel made of this. It's like... <laughs> and now we'll introduce all kinds of really useless garbage. I'm so glad that, uh, that we get to use them so much. I guess you could just feed the twisted meat to wargs, to the animals and stuff. It's probably not something you want to preserve in your freaking fri fridge. Do you need to feed these creatures? Take the stealer. Entity. Health? Log? Doesn't have a, a hunger meter. I don't think you need to maintain their even their hunger. You don't need to feed them. Uh, eventually, crack like back there. Oh, that also. Aha, that's what I was thinking. Like, oh, we, I don't think we need. We have wood. We don't have enough wood. Thing is, if I send people to chop wood out there, they're gonna get ambushed. Pretty hardcore. Evan Damas is gonna get ambushed. You need. Yeah, he is being escorted. How about we give him mother in law as well? Be escorted by all the elephants. Where are the elephants, though? Are they coming? 
They're supposed to escort him. See? Follow master while the master is doing field work. Hunting or taming animals. Ah, but not, not while chopping down trees. Holy crap. I told you, fellas. I told you, fellas! Uh, why? Oh, oh, there's an angry hand. So, what is going to be upsetting? They will attack my... My mechs. Let me... Uh, do we have a mech safety area? No. Let's create a... Rename that mech safety. And we're going to basically put it inside. Like so. Assign the mechs to mech safety. Probably a little too late for our agri hand up there. But better the agri hand than freaking effing damas. Get right back in there, effing damas. This is super dangerous. Now, uh, we're going to take this very seriously because the game told me it is a huge number of creatures here. We never gave Break Soul a weapon. Let me give him one of these LMGs. And uh, where is Filthy Heathen? You know what, Filthy Heathen? I, I don't even trust you enough to give you a weapon. You can just... Uh, you're a trash combatant anyway, so... Just, uh, just chill out. We're going to get everybody. Erica Dawson and Je Jesse also. You can sit this one out as well. Everybody out. Probably would be pretty nice to set them on fire. Go get yourself a weapon, Break Soul. You better don't wig out on me again. Okay, season. Oh. Oh, baby. They are way closer than anticipated. Hopefully, Effing Damage can make it in there. The animals are gonna suffer here. By the way, Effing Damage really should not be. Not Effing Damage. Major Stupid should not be fighting. This poor bastard is. We need to retire him. This sucks. I think we can afford putting everybody out here. Banana, get yourself the marksman command. That's where we're gonna fight. T Rose, get in there. That is quite the number, but it looks like we stopped them exactly where we could defend. It could have been so much worse if I hadn't been so paranoid about it. I'm fortunate about the, the mech. Look at all these. Crazy. Oh, crack like that. It should definitely be over there in the front lines. Over there. A mech. We're not going to throw them into the melee range, obviously. We can just shoot. Oh, Major Stupid. Bruh. <laughs> Major Stupid should not be fighting. Meg, how about you rescue Major Stupid? Hopefully she can get in there. Come on, you can do it. Oh, saved. I hate that these poor animals are getting wrecked. Go back. Let's have the this this complete <laughs> awful melee. Where let me just click on them up here. Oh, that also reminds me, Banana has a Hellcat burner. I don't want to set the elephants on fire, though. Let's just let it be. Uh, let's get him back. Crack like Vagvis should be in the front line. Can you maybe go over here? No, I, don't, I definitely don't want you to go out. Just stay there. I think Hike is, Hike is holding the line. And Meg is carrying Major Stupid. Okay, gotta, gotta pay attention here. What's going on here? Okay, Hike is holding the line. Crack like Vagve. There you are. Who am I selecting right now? Crack like Vagve, that's what you want. Uh, banana, please. Just go fall back. That's where I want you, Crack like Vagve. Just slice them clean. That is so many. But it looks like the elephant is holding strong. 
Gonna maybe throw a blinding pulse out there. I don't think it matters too much. I don't think these creatures are all that driven by their eyesight. Seems that we may be through this. That was a lot. I don't see any more. Are we good? I think we're good. Let's take stock of our wounds. The, the people should be just fine. I think Banana got a little scratched. Effing damage is mad. For some reason. Saw his poor animals get wrecked. Break Soul is not, wasn't even in the fight. Okay. Meg is saving Major Stupid. Are, oof, Major Stupid is really not doing great. Can you do any medical? She can do a little bit of medical. So let's make sure Meg... Oh, Blanger's already on it. He'll get there. He'll get there. Don't worry about it. And of course we have the poor Mech. T-Rose. Carry Agrihand. That is so many live. Please. Paul Agrihand. There you are. So many live uh, sight stealers. This is uh, out of control. Is it even worth butchering them? I doubt it. Oof. <laughs> so many. At least uh, Evan Damage is already on it. He's just a real hungry boy, though. Does anybody have a meal? T Rose, please give Effin Damas this meal. Come on, you can do it. Drop that! That's not your food! Consume the fine meal, mother. I mean, uh, Effin Damas. Alright, so that is the thing that just happened. Major Stupid is being treated. This elephant is okay. Murder Thrust not doing great. Somehow Stump Master got completely scot free. So did Ruffle Stump. What a mess. <laughs> That's terrible. <laughs> All right. Those back to back events. It seemed to be coincidental. Okay. I don't know if it's worth butcher even butchering these things. You just let them rot there. Do I want to capture more than one? I don't think you have to, right? Just one is plenty. Holy crap, man. This poor Major Stupid. Major Stupid, let's just retire him. He will no longer go out and fight. This is just cruel. A cruel thing to do to this poor bastard. Effing Damas, you are now. Your belly's full. I do want you to heal, to, to treat some wounds. We do have um, Ragman. He also has a, a mood break coming up. Can Blargo get it all? Seven hours. Three hours. I don't think Blargo can get it all. Uh, let me risk Kevin Damas getting mad. And let me risk... Actually, Ragman is not a freaking doctor. Uh... Jesse Fassman is a doctor. Still for freaking muscle parasites. Manipulation 33%. Better than zero. Go, uh, go tend murder thrust. Because uh, Blargo might not get our, uh, to all of them. How's he doing? He's fine. He's a little bit of sleep. Not a big deal. Six hours. Six hours. Major stupid. Slowly <laughs> getting patched up. Should put a lamp out here. There you are. It's like the the tending spot for the animals. You really want to butcher that garbage, huh? Seems to me that twisted meat should not even be refrigerated. It can be out here. Let me just storage. 
I don't want twisted meat in my fridges. I don't know if it's worth having or not. Seems though, like, you know, the supply of twisted meat is never going to be short. <laughs> there is. Oh! Okay, it's just flu. Pretty annoying, though. As if these animals haven't suffered enough. Five hours, six hours. Man, th this is just terrible. It's just freaking terrible. I think Dam is going to lose his shit. How are we going to be 50 minutes on the recording? Is this just time? Has twisted and bent. Why are you so mad, huh? Why? Are we out of cooldown yet? No, not for quite a while. Okay, finally. Major Stoop is going to get himself treated nice. Blargo, you can take over now. Tending to murder thrust. This is in four hours. Like, this is still bad. Evan Down, you, you need to go. You need to go sleep. No, you, you you refuse. You're like, no, my elephant. My elephant must be tended to. Please, please go eat. <laughs> this is stressing me out. Go get yourself a fine meal. And then you can sleep. Don't worry. Blargo will take care of mother-in-law. Late stage, stage pregnant, though, we may lose this little uh, little elephant friend. Prison break. <laughs> you idiots! <laughs> how can you possibly... How can you possibly even attempt this? You naked buffoons. You're gonna get punched in the head by all of these people. And that will happen in the next episode.